Walking up to Metroflex game. What? That's me walking up. I'm gonna get in ten. My honey he needs to hurry up. I'm gonna go in there and poo. Cause I gotta poo. Ew. Oh man, pre workout kicks in. I'm shaking. Okay guys, so I put this in slow motion for you so that you can get a good look at the gym. Um, I was early so there weren't a whole lot of people here at this point, um, or there wasn't. And uh, everything's pretty close together, they packed it full, a lot of old machines but there are a few new machines as well. And um, as you can tell I was pretty excited to be there, it was a great environment, very um, encouraging, you know, to have a good workout and everything, um, and everybody's there to work. People don't uh, go to places like this to, you know, do a half-assed workout. Um, as I said earlier, I had to go to the bathroom, so here's the glimpse of the bathroom. Um, lots of, you know, inspiring pictures. It was pretty dirty, but um, lots of pros up there, old school pros, but very uh, motivational so really cool uh, place to work out and we weren't able to work out right away so um, there was a lot of waiting around and um, this was right by the door so I decided to get up on it but um, I didn't I had already taken my pre-workout thinking we'd be able to work out earlier but they didn't let us in until 6 which is understandable because the people that actually work out work out there on a regular basis, you know, they don't want a bunch of FitCon people coming and um, getting in their way, so that is that, all. <laughs> and then, where we at? let's see, so here I think it's just a warm-up, I think, yeah, um, I was trying to go for a PR with my squats, I think I had done it one time before last year, um, my husband doesn't think I was able to get 155. Uh, at that time, but PRs weren't really that important to me, and still aren't like super important. I just want to see progress, but that's one way to mark progress is um, strength. So uh, that was just 135, and this one I can't see what's on there. I want to say they're just tens. Um, so that's 155, I guess, mm -hmm. right there. Just got it up for one, and then this is my PR. Uh, it's 185. 25 pound plates on either side after that 45 and uh, this was a little bit scary because I didn't have a spot because my husband was just like videotaping <laughs> but um here it is up up and as you can see it's a little bit wobbly um, the floor wasn't exactly even and I was stepping back farther than I should taking way too many steps for my setup but I was trying to find ground that wasn't tilted forward. Um, and here's me at failure. I felt like the guy helped me out too soon, but I'm pretty sure I wouldn't have been able to get up, and that was 195. So here's my husband getting pumped up for a 405 squat. Um, pretty heavy. So let's take a look at that. I'm pretty sure he said this would uh, match his PR, so he didn't... Um, get a new one, but I think this is pretty heavy anyways, um, so we'll see. Uh, he has some goals by, uh, I don't know if it's this December or next December, but he's going to be working on um, getting stronger, so that'll be fun to watch. Um, and then here's just some footage of the gym and all the stuff on the wall. Really cool environment. Lots of people are in there. Um, nobody really from YouTube quite yet. They all came a little bit later. I stuck around for a little bit and then I got some footage of it. Um, of uh, like Mike Rashid and Mark Lobliner working out and then um, the ladies that were with them, which was fun to watch them. But for some reason, women just aren't as approachable in the gym. <laughs> Um, but I guess we're kind of conditioned to be that way, so I didn't go and say hi to them, but, um, and then I was able to catch Big J, uh, walking in as I was walking out. And there we are. Had a good time. Thanks so much, Big J. 
Have a good one, guys. More to come.